Yo guys, what is going on? Now, <clears throat> a little bit rough this morning, not going to lie, I'm not going to lie to any of you out there man, as you know, I keep you 100% real on this channel, I will not be fake on camera, but I'll be honest with you, a little bit fragile this morning, yeah, uh, tequila probably took the worst of me last night to be honest, um, but yeah, good night overall, wasn't bad at all, like I said, got in at a reasonable time, had some pizza, fell asleep, woke up this morning, and I feel okay, I feel okay out there. Worldwide footballing fans. So yeah, listen, don't panic. AJT is still up and ready to go. We've yet another upload. Oh, pardon me. <laughs> but yeah, like I say, um, yeah, so what can I say? Oh, well, 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 I know exactly what I'm going to say, but you guys don't know what I'm going to say. So let's get on with the video. As you can see, I don't actually have an England shirt. That's something I don't have. I need to invest in ASAP. But as you guys seen from yesterday, obviously we have my special guest being my brother, Billy. Honestly, having me on the channel once again. I mean, like I say, like I say, because I, like I say, man, a lot of you guys like, obviously, well, let me start again. A lot of you guys like to see the guests on my channel, so that's why I try and get guests on all the time. And like I say, if it's the same faces, doesn't matter, man, because at least you get, at least you guys make a relationship with them. But like I say, honestly, having me on yesterday, we previewed the uh, World Cup prediction sort of thing, uh, and that's the semi finals for England. And uh, Billy said quarter finals and semis, depending on how he's feeling. Now, judge of last night's result, wasn't a bad result, Costa Rica. Fantastic result for us, uh, like I say, 2-0, like I say, 2-0, it was a warm game, but like I say, man, you can't take nothing away from England's performance, I thought the first half, we were good, I thought I thought England were very, very threatening, I remember uh, Costa Rica having one chance in the first half, uh, about uh, Butland had to pull off, a, pull off a great save, but apart from that, first half wise, Costa Rica didn't really harm us, I would say, didn't really, didn't really harm us at all, um, but like I say, man, obviously Rashford's goal, stand up, man, take a bow, because that was absolutely class, Rashford's goal was just... Whoa, wow, I mean, what's that one there? Because I say, it all started, obviously, obviously, we've been watching like this. I was sort of saying like this, thinking, come on, someone, come on, someone, do something. Rashford gets it, just pings it across the goal, and he made it look easy, man. Look, look like look like he's been doing it 20, 25 years, man. Do you know what I mean? Looks so, look so experienced, he took the shot on. I mean, he took the shot on when he was top bin. And I say, great, great strike from Marcus Rashford, made it 1 0 to England, went in the break 1 0. Um, brilliant first half, you know what I mean? I, you know what I mean, um, I, as I've already said, you know what I mean? Great first half. Uh, obviously, England quite the second half. Um, about 60 minutes went. Uh, I say England made a couple of changes. Danny Melbourne came on. Um, Nick Pope came on to replace Jack Butland, who, you know, Jack Butland, will he be our first first goalkeeper in the Russia? I doubt, I doubt he'll be the number one. I think Jordan Pickford will get it. But I say, man, Nick Pope came on as well. Danny Welbeck came on the pitch. I say, man, a few players came on. Deli Ali. I say, man, a few came on. Deli, 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 Deli Ali actually assisted the second one. I say, man, it looked like a shot. It looked like a shot first, but I'm pretty sure it was a cross. I say, we crossed it across the box. Danny Welbeck put his head on the end of it. Hit the post and went in. I first looked like he was going to miss, but I say, hit the post and went in. Great goal for Danny Welbeck. And you know what I mean? I know I've slayed Danny Welbeck in the past, um, based on his Arsenal, Arsenal season this season for me. I don't think he's done enough at Arsenal. I know he might have been, had injuries and whatnot, but you know, I was one of the people that said, "Why is Danny Welbeck going to Russia if he hasn't had the, if he hasn't had the greatest seasons?" Now it's because he plays, is it because he plays for a top team, being Arsenal. And I say top team because let's be real, Arsenal are always top six every season. Um, but like I say, like I say, my credit to him, credit to him for getting the goal. Um, like I say, man, like I say, like I say man, Danny Welbeck should be like me up. So well done, Danny Welbeck for getting the goal. And like I say, man, overall two 0 win. It's positive, do you know what I mean? Obviously, obviously coming off the, coming off that win last night, obviously we won it well. Just say going to that game last night, obviously coming off the result against uh, Nigeria on Saturday after beating M two one as well. So I like say my two wins, I say um, and I like say my I like say my other lads fly out to Russia, obviously whenever whenever they do. But I know that was the last game, and, that, and obviously Russia's in a uh, I think it's a week a week yesterday it starts. So buzzing, buzzing for the World Cup. I say man, uh, I say man, I'm gonna try, I'm trying, I'm gonna, I say man, I'm gonna try and. Uh, I'm gonna try and cover different things uh, based on the World Cup, be, be, pretty much every single day with be, with it, with it be a different game on. If you guys would like to see me, maybe I don't know, preview maybe. So say if it's like, so say for if we say for example, it's Spain v Portugal, and then say there's like one say like India versus Costa Rica, would you guys want to see me sort of preview maybe preview maybe the top game being? By obviously Portugal v Spain. I say, if you guys want to see me, maybe he's just maybe he's trying to touch on, just touch, maybe he's touch on a, say just touch on a massive. I say, man. So if you guys want to see me cover, say, um, a massive game, for instance, I will do that. Absolutely no problem. I'll cover a massive game. Just let me know down in the comment section down below. But like I say, overall for England, two and a win. Happy days. Um, and like I say, great performance by all the boys. I don't think one player put a foot wrong. One player for me that has to start has to start in Russia, and I know a lot of people may not agree. 
It's Ruben off the street. Man, that guy's class. He's absolute. I've been saying it since he was a kid. I've been saying it, you know what I mean? I've been saying it since he was in the 21s. Ruben off the cheek is a class player. He's got to be in a standard level in Russia for me. He's, I mean, I watched him last night. And, he, you know what I mean? Ruben off the cheek, I hardly put a foot wrong last night. Do you know what I mean? He's absolutely class. He's, he is, he is, honestly, man, for his age that he is, he's a class player. And he's got to be in a standard level in Russia for me. Ruben off the cheek, what a player he is. I say, obviously, Michael Trashman picked up the man of the match award. Fair play. And I say, overall, you know what I mean? Overall, as England fans now go, obviously. Obviously, obviously, England fans that go out to Russia will be safe. But obviously, us England fans that stay at home. You now, I mean, everyone goes out there now and everyone cheers on the boys. And hopefully, hopefully, we can have a good tournament. It's the most important thing because, like I say, a lot of tough teams in this World Cup as there is every single World Cup, every single Euros. You know, I mean, Brazil are in there, Portugal, Spain, Argentina, uh, Germany. Do you know what I mean? Do you know I mean? There's a lot of top teams in there. But England, that, that, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? It's almost time to step up now. So. I say, man, massive, 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 massive couple of weeks coming up for England now, but it's time to prove ourselves against the rest of the world, I think. And I say, I say, man, we'll see what happens. But I say, man, I said England to get to semi-finals, because I honestly think England will do well this year. I honestly, I honestly do. I should, say, I should say this World Cup. I think England will do well. I really, really do. So hopefully, like I say, man, hopefully the boys can step up to the plate. And hopefully, we'll come back for that shiny World Cup back to England. Who knows? I do hope so. But like I say, this has been the review of England versus Costa Rica. We won 2-0. We all go to Russia. We've got a book of the Vindaloo. Up England.